to the Dancing with the Stars Season 23 cast reveal. Wow, Season 23. I remember the novelty of this show when it came on for Season 1. And it had that tiny little cast. Yeah, it, it was, was like only a few people. Yeah, basically, wasn't it just like at the end of the summer? Um, it was kind of like a mid-season replacement kind of thing. It was a long time ago. But let's not talk about that. It was so exciting, though, back then because it was like, America just does like line dancing and stuff. They don't have no ballroom. <laughs> yeah, um, it's been going on for a long time, but like not. It's definitely like a European well, I mean, Type there's sport. been ballroom in the U.S., but it just hasn't it's been, been mainstream. Yeah, you know, you watch PBS, and then that's yeah. pretty much it. Yeah. But anyway, Season let's look 23. ahead to the future. All right, we've got a great cast that was revealed today. It's all an interesting cast. It's diverse. I'm really excited about the pros, too. They brought back some old faves. Yeah. Got some new blood in there. Yeah. It's going to be fun. I love it. Let's start right off with the criminal, Ryan Lockley. Oh. <laughs> Just oh kidding. He's, he's in trouble, but like... He lost all of his sponsorships. He needs this paycheck. He really does. And he better watch out because he is teamed up with Cheryl Burke and she oh, doesn't take any S. Snap. No, she's like known for... You do it or you die. <laughs> Remember when that article came out not that long ago, I'm like a few hearing? months ago? Oh, yeah. Oh, my oh, God. Yeah. But, yeah, she's back. I'm excited. I like her. Yeah, I love her. Yeah. she She's no nonsense, and I like that in a pro. Yeah. He's been in four Olympics, 12 medals. He ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> it's going to be interesting, I'm definitely. a little worried for him, and I'm, I'm really worried for her, because he's, like, permanently in a fog. He's always just, like... Yeah, okay, whatever. Can yeah, he said that he's not a dancer, so she's got her work cut out for her. Well, either he will be or... All right, well, <laughs> let's talk about the other Olympian this season. Lori Hernandez! Yay! Oh, I love her! With Val, the human emoji. She's only, what, 16? Is she? Yeah, I guess She's so. She's really young. She just broke out onto the gymnastic oh scene. Gosh, I love it. <laughs> she reminds us so much of the uh, character that Rihanna uh, voiced in the movie Home. Yeah, tip. Love it. So cute. She's going to be so good at this. I think she's going to be good. I think she's going to be a contender. Absolutely. We've seen, you know, multiple gymnasts on the show before, and, and all they always do well. well. Yeah. I think she's got the personality for it. Yeah. Maureen McCormack. TV Whoa. star and reality TV star. <laughs> it's Marsha Brady. Yeah. Typically, she's paired up with Artem. <laughs> Poor Artem. Why? She, she's a, Give him somebody she's young. Brady. Maybe he wants, like, a challenge. I don't know. Maybe she's going to be good. Who knows? All right. But That's is this true. only the second Brady that they've had on the show? Yeah. They had the mom, Florence Henderson. Right. I feel like they should have every Brady come on. I think so, too. That would be amazing. <laughs> Uh, good luck. <laughs> she's been on a lot of other reality uh, shows. She's with a great reality partner. Shows. Yeah. He can make her look really good if she's not, which is good. Okay. All right. And another guy who can make people look good. Max is back. What? And he's paired up with Amber Rose. He hasn't been on since Meryl, uh -oh. right? Yeah. Since the one with Meryl. Yeah. She's a little controversial, but she you know is. what? Yeah, right? <laughs> no, when I heard that Amber Rose was going to be on and I heard that Max was coming back, I was like, oh, shit. You know, yeah, they're going to put those two she together. Did. She did You know, they're going to put those two together. She's a model. She's a mother. She's a talk show host. She's an entrepreneur. She's an activist. She does it all, baby. Mm -hmm. She's also the ex of Kanye. <sighs> there's, so, <laughs> oh, there's so much drama it's there. Like a, Sto uh, you know, perfect storm there. Yeah. I'm excited to hear more about her backstory because I feel like most of what we hear about her in the media relates to Kanye, and I mm -hmm. want to learn more about her as a person. Typically, though, models on this show they don't do, so don't do well. Yeah, we'll see, all. though. I don't know. We'll right. see. Tara Jolet. What? Yes! Little Women LA! Yes! Tara's little family! Oh, I'm excited about her. I'm so excited for this. She's a big personality. She is. Absolutely. And... She is teamed up with Sasha. She's the first little person to ever be on the show. No, Sasha is. <laughs> oh, gosh. 
He's really short. He's perfect for her. I love this matchup. I think they're going to do really well. Yeah. I think she's going to be a lot of fun to watch because, like I said, huge personality. Well, she's so going to be fun. Sasha. He's always playing all the pranks mm -hmm. and everything. Mr. Prankster. It's going to be great. It's going to be good. And she's not just on Little Women, but she's also she's a, a producer. producer. God, I didn't realize that she produced all those other uh, I'm so thrilled cities for her. in the franchise. Yeah. That's crazy. That's great. Mary Lou Henner. Oh, my God. <laughs> and Derek? Derek Huff is back? for Derek Huff? Well, he wasn't even supposed to be on this season because he was going to be doing singing, singing in the Rain on Broadway, but that was pushed back a little bit. So now he's back. Very excited to see him again. Usually he gets the pick of the litter. Were they like, you know what? If you want to be on the show, we're going to let somebody else have the pick of the litter. Somebody else is getting Lori. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> You're going to have to deal with someone else. And he was probably like, you know what? I can't sit still for two seconds. I'll do it. I think that Mary Lou is going to be good, though. I think she's I think she's going to be a real sleeper. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, people don't expect a lot because they don't know her career. Hasn't she been on, like, Broadway? She's been and... in a bunch of Broadway shows. She's been on TV, right? Yeah. Movies. Does she do TV? Yeah, she did yeah. Taxi. Yeah, duh. Wow. <laughs> and, she um, did Celebrity Apprentice. She's also made the rounds on the reality, reality TV, TV show. Circuit. Yeah, um... She's very healthy. She's written like 10 books. She's a vegan. I think she's going to give Derek a run for his money. I think she's going to be really good. And I think she's going to take so. it seriously and work yeah. really hard. So I'm she excited to see She's definitely a hard table. worker. She also has this like gift that she remembers like her entire life. And what like is she going to pick then for that, you know, life. that memory week? I you know, don't greatest know. year, whatever. <laughs> I remember everything. <laughs> well, it's meaningful. I know. Yeah. I'm just kidding. All right. Rick Perry. Oh, Former boy. Governor Rick Perry of Texas. It is an election year, so. You know the uh, political ones don't tend to do so well either, like the models. They Which, fall in the same uh, slots. It kind of sucks because he's paired with Emma, and I love Emma. <laughs> She's so great. Emma always gets... Not promising. Uh, well, well, she did good. You know, a few seasons ago, she was around for a long time. Yeah, with the... With um, Mr. Vine. Yeah, and with the other guy who made it to, like... Oh, um, yeah, yeah, Bill Engvall. Bill Engvall. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. This guy ran for president, like, a hundred times. How long will he last on the show? I don't know. Thank you for your military service, though. Yes. All right, next up. Disney star Jake T. Austin. Disney's in the house. He's barely legal at 21. The Wizards of Waverly Place. <laughs> I'm so excited for this because Jenna has become full grown. Yay! Oh my god. We've been wanting this for season after season because she's fantastic. We she finally fantastic. got it. I think this is going to be a good this partnership. This is her year because like, she was a pro on So You Think You Could Dance this season. Also, this uh, she's season working. that's on right now. Oh my gosh, is it on? She's going to be doing two dancing shows at the same time, or will they be wrapped? I don't know. They just... might be wrapped by the okay. time. Because it's like another two I weeks. I think they're getting close to the end. Okay. Yeah. Wow. But she's great. I'm excited for her. I'm great. And I think they're going to be I, good together. I'm great. No, <laughs> I'm thinking it's going to be great. Is she still dating Val? I don't know. I was never really confirmed. Okay. But... <laughs> I hope so too, because I think they make. I think they'd be good together. Good, yeah, good couple. <laughs> All right, Calvin Johnson, thirty-year-old, or I guess he's retired. I'm pretty sure he's retired. How would he not be retired? And you know, imagine being retired at the age of thirty. <sighs> Moved to He's, Portland. No, you live in a dream, man. And now you're on Dancing with the Stars with Lindsay. Yeah, but for people like me who don't watch football. He was on the Detroit Lions. He's his nickname. <laughs> I guess is he's kind Megatron. of a big deal. He's a huge deal. He's the best wide receiver of all times. All time. Illuminati confirmed. Okay. <laughs> all right. But he's dancing with Lindsay, so that's yeah. back to back football for Lindsay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. I'm excited for this. Do you think he's going to be good? The football players usually do pretty well. They usually do pretty well. I mean, it's a little treat for the guys who are forced to watch this show and for the girls who like football. <laughs> so, yeah. I think we'll he'll do pretty that. well. <laughs> Can But will he be able to do the Antonio, the... Ah! I hope not, because that's reserved 
<laughs> for Antonio, okay? All right. That's not for everybody. We've got Kenny, Babyface, Edmonds. Yay! And Allison's back She's after back. a baby. Damn. She looks I like hope if I ever have a baby, so I look that good, good after. <laughs> You didn't have any doubt, did you? She, no, because she's, she's amazing. amazing. She's a machine. All right. This guy wrote and produced, like, every song in the world. Yeah. He was he had a cameo on Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, <laughs> along with David Foster. Yep. <laughs> I mean, come on. This guy knows music, so... He's great. Can his body... Yeah, I think he's going to have that musicality. Yeah. I think he's going to be pretty good. But he's a little bit older. Mm -hmm. Can his body do what he wants it to do? I think he could be good. Well, he's with Allison, so he's got a great partner. True. Vanilla Ice. What? It's like a hundred <laughs> years ago. Ice, ice, baby. What? Wait, what week are they going to pull that out? Uh, I'd say two. I'd say two. I would two. guess two. All right. You know, everybody knows Vanilla Ice. He, uh... He's going to be dancing with Whitney. So all three Utah girls are pros Yes. He's got, like, a home construction show now. <laughs> I never would have guessed that. Well, I know? guess, like, after he was dangled from a uh, Vegas hotel by Biggie Smalls, you know, he his career was kind of over, and then um, he had to do something, and he kind of melded what he knows with what he, you know, his fame. So, great. Good for him. Yeah. And he definitely I mean, apparently it's a good show, too. Yeah. Definitely he can dance, so he's definitely going to he? be a contender. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He's going to be a contender. <laughs> All right. All right. I don't know if he can dance ballroom, but... We'll see. James Hinchcliffe. I don't know race car drivers. I know but nothing about car racing. Driver. Who's he driving for? I don't know. How many Talladega Nights jokes <laughs> will there be? He's dancing with Sharna. He does... Indy car though is that yeah, the Indy tiny car. car or is that the regular car? I'm not sure. I think that's the regular car. Don't they all drive big cars. No, because like there's a little one too. Do they even? Is that like a thing? Like, I think that might be bigger in Europe. I don't know. Okay. But he, I think that's the regular car. He's like won the Indianapolis 500, I think, mm -hmm. a bunch of times. Or I don't know. We'll find, you know what? We'll find out by we will watching learn the about show. It. Yeah, we'll learn about it. And he's with Sharna, big personality. Great choreographer. I'm excited to see what she pulls out of him because I don't really know. Makes her partners about him look yet. great. Mm -hmm. So good luck. Uh, <laughs> and final dancer, Gina Kramer. She's with Gleb. Mm -hmm. Remember Gleb? The last time we've seen Gleb as a pro was, uh, was it? Lisa I didn't see that season, so I'm not familiar oh, wow. with Gleb. Gleb is good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So she's a country, uh, country singer. singer. She won top female art, top new female artist, and I believe in she toured with Blake Shelton. Yes, yeah, she did. So, so she's like up and coming, big deal. So she can like do this up on stage. Can she like do a whole <laughs> dance? We'll find we'll out. See, yeah, yeah. I'm sure there'll be some, you know some country hints in there too. You know, hey, why don't we throw in a little two step over here? Yeah. <laughs> all right. Julianne is back. Julianne Huff. She's gonna be a judge again. She's We've all got double huffs. I was on Grease Live, and now I'm back. <laughs> yeah, and I'm getting married soon, probably too. Right? Although they haven't set a date. They've been engaged for a while, but that's really yeah. she's. I I really like her as a judge. I think uh, she adds a lot. To, she adds that youth. To I the like show. her better. As a pro, I miss her as a dancer. I miss her as a pro, but you know what? Those three geezers on the panel of uh, judges, I like to see a little youth in there too. True, true. And she's also, you know, she has a ballroom background, unlike some of the judges. But whatever. Um, yeah. It's gonna be weird though without Mark Ballas or Tony this season, because I mean they've been around for what so long. What the hell? You gave us a little taste of Edita, and now she's gone again. I know. <laughs> Would she get disgusted? She got thrown out in like week one last season. I don't season? know. Maybe so I'm not even gonna do this anymore. Maybe she'll be making an appearance. I don't know. That would be great. But let us know in the comments what you guys think of this cast. We're actually not going to be covering episode by episode this season, but we will be talking about it, you know, here and there in our daily vlogs on our other channels. So. Possibly on social media as well, Twitter, yeah. or whatnot. Our schedule's just too crazy this fall. Yeah. But we will be watching. So let us know who you're excited about. And until next time, 
Much, Much love. love. Two, one. Edit. 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 Edit.